Good day, Lordicians. Praise be Jesus and Mary. Let me begin our library orientation with this quote from J.K. Rowling that says, When in doubt, go to the library. But how can we go to the library with our situation right now with this pandemic? Worry no more because our library, the Learning Commons, is accessible online. Through our online services that I will briefly introduce to you during this orientation. This is the outline of our orientation today. First, I will introduce to you the library staff. We will also do um, a quick virtual tour to the physical library and I will also briefly discuss to you the library online catalog, the online databases that we have in the Learning Commons, and the online services that we provide to all users of the library. The faces you see now in the screen are the librarians in the Learning Commons. We have from the left side, from the left, uh, Mom Annabel Asidera, our graduate school librarian, Mom Melody R. Agsito, our library coordinator, yours truly, Esther Lynn Platino, I am the collection and processing librarian, and Mom Sheila Lianda, Sheila May Lianda, our senior high librarian. We also have uh, our partners at the library, the library staffs. We have um, from the left, Mr. Crisel Naabot, our Reference and User Services Assistant. Ma'am Rosalita Montejo, our Collection and Processing Clerk. Mr. Eric Butad, our AV in charge. And Mr. Roldan, our Grade School Library in charge. So let's have the virtual tour. This is uh, from the left side. Uh, is the entrance of the Learning Commons and adjacent to it, the middle, uh, middle image is the concierge where the students can inquire, borrow and return books and other library materials, uh, learning materials in the library. We also have in the first floor uh, the seminar room where, which can be used for meetings and seminars. We also have in the first floor a uh, net zone which, which has 27 computer units and is fully equipped with internet. There is also a carrel uh, at the middle image intended for individual study or silent study. And we also have a tutorium for faculty and students consultation. In the second floor, we have uh, Two collaboratory rooms for which um, the students can use for group studies with their classmates or their peers. And one highlight also of the Learning Commons is the availability of coffee station where students and all users of the library can have their coffee break. We also have uh, in the second floor reading areas with sofas where students can comfortably sit and read. Because of the pandemic, the library users weren't able to visit the physical library. And questions arise like, how can we know if the library has this particular title or particular book? The Learning Commons answer uh, this question with the provision of OPAC or online public access catalog, which can be accessed remotely using the URL presented in the screen. So that URL will direct you to the login interface. Remote, remote access means wherever you are, as long as you have an internet connection, you can browse the books and other learning materials available in the library. The Learning Commons also provides the students and all users of the library with databases where students can access legit sources of information in 
electronic format which can use which can be used for your research and information needs. And take note, these databases are, are accessible wherever you are, as long as you have an internet connection. And you have the URL and username and password for each of the databases. Currently, the library has subscription to four databases, which I will briefly introduce a little later. This database says, cost almost half a million and if you have asked this question why is there a library fee where in fact you cannot use um, the library or physically the library your library fee is a portion to each of these databases and other subscription in the library so what are these databases first we have gale syngage learning Gales Engage provides with full text articles, abstract citations, as well as ebooks and videos. So please take note of the link uh, in the second. We have ProQuest. ProQuest is a multidisciplinary database which will give you scholarly journals in full text, magazines, and dissertation in all subject areas. Just take note of the link. We also have uh, Emerald Insight. This database is a specialized database. It includes full-text scholarly journals, magazines, and dissertation in the subject area of hospitality and tourism, management, and library studies. Last, we have World Book Database. This database provides the students or the users, full text journal articles, ebooks, educators tools, audio clips, and downloadable videos on various disciplines covering the social sciences, humanities, health related sciences, and contemporary issues. Okay, how can we avail the services of the library even if we cannot physically visit the library? Learning Commons provides students with the following services. We have first Ask a Librarian service, Lira or Library Research Assistance, Book Borrowing Online, Library Scanning, Open eBooks Alert, and Information Literacy Sessions. Ask a Librarian service provides way for the library users to inquire and interact with the librarian through the following medium of communication. You can send an email to learning.commons at lccdo.edu.ph. You can also message us through our FB page. And for you to be kept updated with our latest posts and announcements, please like and follow our FB page. You can also reach the librarian through uh, these cell, cell phone numbers. For college, um, 0916-980-5275. And for senior high, 0975-977-4668. Next, we have Lira. Lira is, uh, in short, is short term for library research assistance. It is a web form that provides answers to your research questions and find information sources that you need how to borrow books online you can borrow by following the process first so search for the title of the book using the library online catalog and send your request through the web form or lira send your request through lira the library also provides scanning service of printed materials you can avail this service by following this procedure first you browse the title of the book or the journal journal using the library online catalog and send your request through lira another service that we provide is open ebooks alert um, this service provides free downloadable ebooks and are posted ebooks that we provide are posted every week in the learning commons fb page we also conduct information literacy sessions 
section and it contains four modules. Module one uh, topic is where to find information. Module two is evaluating sources. Module three is formulating search strategies. And last module is referencing and academic honesty. These are the online services that the Learning Commons provides for the users of the library. So details on how to avail these online services will be discussed to you during the program meeting as well as how to use effectively the databases that we have in the Learning Commons. For more information about our library, please visit our library website with the link provided in the screen. And also, please subscribe to our YouTube channel. Just search Shub LC Learning Commons. So this is us from the Learning Commons saying, Kapag kailangan mo ng information, huwag maghihiyang ng kami. Thank you and stay safe.